Gay Fad Studios once was a cornerstone of Lancaster's industry. It moved to Lancaster in 1945 and produced hundreds of designs. Today, the glass is sought by collectors worldwide. A mural in Lancaster's Central Alley painted by artist Jason Annecy reflects designs and colors from the prized glassware pieces. It's, it's a story that has honestly kind of, um, kind of quieted down in the area. And so there was an opportunity to actually revive this story. Krista Moody, past president of the Lancaster Rotary, whose parents worked in the Anchor Hawking Glass Factory for many years, led the effort to beautify the alley. Uh, we've added the lighting, we've put the planners, the tables, and now with my project, we're adding the mural. This was something that I wanted to do. I wanted this area to be a fun area, something for all generations to come and enjoy. Um, in the past, we've had a lot of people stop and take pictures in the alley. Annecy showed me one of his favorite gay fad studio pieces. This was a very interesting process that I wasn't aware of until Fran's daughter came to visit. So what they would initially do is uh, cut the piece of glass and then they would end up uh, actually silk screening on the various color patterns and then the gold was added after that. And after they ended up doing all of the patterning, they would then mold it. As a give back to Lancaster's community, Annecy donated his time to the project. The county really embraces art. Um, it's something that I've never experienced in all of my years of painting and illustrating, uh, doing graphic design. I've done a wide variety of things, but this is a town uh, that I've just really seen a high amount of trust in artists and celebration. On Friday, July 23rd, the Art Walk kicks off the Lancaster Festival. Jason and Krista will be at the mural from 6 p.m. to 9 p.m. The festival runs through July 31st. For the digital team, this is Cynthia Rossi on NBC4i.com.